Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel Asian Programmer. Today we are gonna learn about functions, but today lecture is about how you pass the parameter in functions. There are three ways you can pass the parameter in functions. Number one, pass by value. Pass by value. Number two, number two is pass by reference. Number three is pass by pointers. So there are three ways in, with which you can uh, send the parameters to the function. Let's start with the one. Make integer function pass by value and in which I will make two integers a and integer b. That's it. We can also make this void and void means you do not require to write the return value in the end and you will not return any value back to the function and you will just do the function here and print out if you need. We will just print out like C out value okay C out value of A okay value of A is value of B is in function okay we'll just do like this okay we have just written there the, the c out in function value of a is this and value of b is this we just print out the value of a and b in the function value pass by value we will make same function but this time we gonna we gonna pass it with reference let's say integer address of a and integer address of b and this is passed by reference okay now you're gonna see the value of a in function we will make this c and d c C and D and one D here. That's the value by reference. The another method of sending value is pass by pointers. In this, you will just make pointer A inside and integer pointer B inside like this we'll just wanna copy this and paste this and we'll change it to e e f and f and we will also require to change these values as well okay now let's make and let's make integers integer a b c d e and we will assign the values now we should perform any function in here and see there is a change we will just give value a is equals to 1 and b is equals to 1 similarly here we will give c is equals to 1 and d is equals to 1 and e is equal to 1 and f is equal to 1 okay sorry it's a pointer so i have to mention like this there you go now we will give the values of a equal 1 we will give value to a equal 1 okay b equal 2 c equal d a 3 d equal 4 e equal 5 
f equals 6 okay you can do this just by putting the semicolon I don't think well, it's showing error but it should not be any error okay we haven't made any f but I have to make an f as well here you go f so you can write this in one line too I was just doing it to find my error that's why I just put it down and then it came back okay so we give values to the a to f 1 2 3 4 5 6 okay 1 to 6 now what you gonna do we will pass we will uh, we will gonna print c out uh, value of a in main is this value of b in main is this okay and afterwards we will just send uh, value of a to pass by value function of a and b that's it okay we will run it we will run this first okay when we will run it you will see that now look at this value of a in main is 1 value of b in main is this which is 2 okay in function value of a is 1 value of b is 1 okay the both the values of a is 1 and b is 1 no 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 changes in, the, in it because we pass it by value so when we pass the pass the value by uh, when we uh, send the value to uh, by a parameter in the function by value then it makes an alias and it doesn't have any change in the real value of a the real value which we send from the main function now let's do another thing we just need to like value of c here and value of d in the main function and we have to like pass by reference in which we will pass by reference the value of c and the value of d now we are sending this value by reference pass by reference function okay this function which we have made like this in which we have specified the address of c and address of d so if we make any changes it will make the changes on the address of c and the address of d where the value of c and d is saved okay now let's run it again now look the value of c in main the value of c in main is 3 the value of b in main is 4 but you have seen in function in function the value of a c is 1 and the value of d is 1 the difference is when you pass the value by reference if you make any changes with it the original value of the uh, the, uh, the original value of the variable which you have created in the main function it will also be changed so you have to be careful with the address uh, address passed by uh, reference when you sending the parameters by reference okay you have to be more careful that if you make any changes then it's gonna be changed the real value as well so now let's do the third one okay the third function is pass by pointer so we will just have to write e and f in the main function now we have to pass the value by pointer pass value by pointers okay and in in that we just need to give e and f but with an address because the, there is a pointer in that functions which will get the pointer will get the address of e and f as well so when we gonna like print these the difference you're gonna see is like that now read it with me the value of e in main is 5 while the value of f in main is 6 and in function the value of e is 1 and the value of f is 1 as well because the values change on the address as well because the pointer and the address function they both work similar so if you make any changes 
while passing the value through pointer or by reference and you make the changes with the original with the value you have sent it then it will gonna change on the real value but if you send the value with the by value thing by value function parameters then the the real value of the variable does not affect it by that so you have to be careful when you are sending the value by reference and by pointers and that's it for the lecture i hope you guys like it do like and subscribe my channel thanks everyone bye bye do give your